hello and welcome to the show. Um, welcome back to Adventures and Backlogging. Here we are again with Red Dead Redemption. Um, and following the uh, rather abrupt end to the last to the last episode, we're um, going to go and pick up where we left off and go see Bonnie again. So I didn't mean to start that mission in the last episode. I had to finish it off. Um, so we're going to get stuck into it this time. Just riding over there right now. So the weather's stopped. The weather's improved, which is nice. There's an awful lot of rain last time we were playing this. Okay. Let's see what's cracker lacking. It's got Bonnie so upset. Where is she? There we go. The burning ominous name. Ooh. Excuse me, Mr. Marston. Attractive face. Have you seen my father anywhere? No. He went out this morning to ride the land and was supposed to be back hours ago. <gasps> Definitely dead. Oh, I've got a war horse again. My horse keeps changing colour. It's very strange. I've got a bad feeling about this. Not like him to be away for so long. Don't worry. I'll bet. We'll find him. He's not as young as he used to be. What if he's hurt himself? Your father can still handle himself just fine, Mr. Farland. He's built like an oak. You're probably right. But I can't help worrying. He's all I've got. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Don't you have any brothers or sisters, Miss McFarland? I had six brothers, but five of them died, either from sickness or foolish choices. And the other one? He left for the east and never came back. Must be getting on for ten years ago now. Oh. He's a high and mighty banker in New York, according to his last letter. He should be here, helping you and your pa. I don't want his help. He can live his life any way he wants. True. When I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe, I fear a little for his soul. He switched his saddle for a tie, and that's fine. I just never met a man in a tie I could trust. Hmm. Very shrewd, Bonnie, very shrewd. Oh no. Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. Maybe the baller twins that bunch. And you head back to the ranch right now. Fetch your wagon. Yes, sir. Marston, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. We are going to get back and he's going to be dead. Those poor men. And their horses were dead too. I think we should get back there as soon as we can. Who could have done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. Hmm. Those damn rustlers. I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's Basin myself. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men have you killed? Do you really want to know? It's disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in. Like there was some twisted morality to what I'm you I'm getting schooled here. I have a code. Only some of us don't realize. The outlaw with the code? How wonderfully romantic. The reluctant murderer. The noble criminal. There's nothing more depressing than a man who's found a way to think the bad ends of good. Oh my god. The barn's on fire. Okay, here we go. What a windmill that's on fire? Fucking hell. Put it 
Come on. Come on, up you get, up you get, up you get, come on. Climb into a fucking burning building, why don't you? Why not? Get in, oh, hello. Yeah, this isn't good. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Oh. Inside job, huh? Yeah, you can't do that, Bon. Get out there! Oh, shit. Oh, yeah! Oh, no! Fucking way! Honestly. Open the pod bay doors, Hal. Yeah, that's not working so well for you, is it, Bonnie? Now, can we please not have anyone walking in front of the goddamn... There we go. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. You sure know how to handle yourself. Thanks, Marcy. Yes, John, thanks. You, well, you saved the ranch. If you'll excuse me, I've got chores to attend to. Hey, hold on a second over there. Sincerely, John. Thank you. Well, did all I could, Miss McClellan. Sorry about all the damage. Hmm. Daddy seems to really want you out of here. Yeah, well, my father fought Indians. I seriously think we're going to be frightened by some white... Lip sync's gone a bit funny. Well, they don't frighten me. Good. John, my family owes you a great debt. I think you got enough debt. You saved my life. All I ask of you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people like my dad. Of course, Mr. Munson. It'd be my pleasure. Good times. Well, you get some rest. I will, Bonnie. I've got to go see how my father's doing. Well, oh, poor Bonnie. Oh, yeah. People are loving me. And as well they should. I'm wonderful. Ay, ay, ay. Right. Get some ammo. Get some sleep. That was pretty cool. 
That was the best Bonnie mission so far, anyway. I enjoyed that. I wonder if... I wonder where her story's going. Alright, what have I got now? What's on the map? Uh, that's flowers for that. That's where I need to go back to when I get those flowers for... All the old dude. Looks like it's time to go back to... Oh, there's another American Appetite bit. Let's, let's go see what that's about, huh? No! I didn't mean to. Oh, this is just so unwieldy. I'll tell you what. Get the camp up. Get the camp up. I need to look into that treasure map to see where that actually is because I don't want to spend fucking forever looking for it. Off we go to Armadillo. Let's see what's what. I've really got to stop doing that. I've really got to stop doing that. That's where West Dickens is going. I'm wondering if I can get into here without... Ah, yeah, I can. Oh, no, I can't. Move. What? Oh, no. Oh, no. Seen since yesterday afternoon. You know, I don't think I can cope. If I lose another child, now, Drew, nobody's lost anything yet. I'm sure she's fine. Oh, Mr. Marshall! Mr. Marshall! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Who the hell's that? Hey, bud! Just tell me what you got to do. Say it. Even better! Good day, Mr. McFarland. Get down from that horse, boy, or I'll shoot you. I wouldn't recommend that, mister. Not if Drew McFarlane wants to see his bunny back in one piece. Hey, Mr. McFarlane! It's a nice girl you got there. Get out from there! You know, part of me's got to thinking I should just marry her myself. Give her a baby and that. What do you want? That's better. I want Norman Deke. I want him set free. Then you'll get your daughter back, mister. We don't do deals with outlaws, boy. Yeah, you do. Let's not waste each other's time pretending otherwise. Whole government themselves ain't much more than a bunch of crooks. This is the land it's nice to see that the confidence in the American government has always been that low. I'm gonna kill this dude. I'm gonna fucking murder him. You do as he says. You and me, Marshal. Mr. McFarland, I'll get you your daughter back. Damn right. Please, Emma. Damn right. I'm not seeing Bonnie die. Fuck that. Deputy, make sure he's tied on the end. Stay with me, 
Carson! I won't let anything happen to it, sir. All right. Two right. Oh, that's a. I can't fucking steer this horse. See, this is what happens when the Federals interfere in our affairs. Are you happy now? No, I ain't happy at all. And I already told you, I ain't with the government. Now you say that, John, but the only thing I know for sure is who sent you. They made me come here. They gave me no choice. That's your federal government, Mr. Johnson. Mm. They come down here dressed as cocky as the King of Diamonds, talking a lot of flannel about helping us, about spreading peace and civilization to the West. Nothing but trouble and taxes. I agree with you. Wolves in sheep's clothing, all of them, rob you, then make you pay to have someone investigate the crime on your behalf. People around here have been fooled into feeling protected when they're worse off than they were before. Mm. I know don't care about people. All they care about is lining their pockets. Yeah. It's just sound awfully familiar, I must admit. <laughs> Don't ever use that line near your deputy. You know, for his sake, they best not have laid a finger on Miss McFarland. Yeah, John's gonna go on a killing spree. Tumbleweed, a lonely god forsaken place. Some people say it's haunted. I mean it's called Tumbleweed, so Good to know. Oh no. I just hope you're not taking advantage of the McFarland, Parson. They saved my life. Gave me food and bed when they had no idea who I was. I owe them more than I can ever repay. That's just they've been through a lot. Well, they're both vulnerable, different ways. I wouldn't have been running in and out of a burning barn to save their horses otherwise. Oh, I know you helped, just like you helped me. But you got your reasons for doing it. It's no secret why I'm here, Marshal. I told you the very first time I walked into your office. I trust mm. you. Listen, all this business with Blackwater and Williamson in the past, I don't know. Sometimes it's hard not to have doubts. I understand. I never planned to be in the lawman business. No, I don't suppose you did. Come on. I just need to go and say Bonnie. That's all I want to do is just go and say Bonnie. There have to be rules, Marston. Even you must understand that. It's easy to make up rules, but they ain't much use if people don't understand why. Like my son. If I tell him not to do something, he'll do it anyway, just to spite me. If I punish him, he resents me for it. But if I show him why it's wrong, at least he has reason not to do it again. That's nonsense. Without laws, we're nothing more than animals. You look at Zeke here. Hmm. You have laws. Just chooses to ignore him. He does it again. Whack him harder. You're a good man, Marshal. And I respect what you're trying to do. But from what I've seen since I've arrived here, the law ain't really. It is not. Criminals are like weeds, Marston. Quick as you stomp one out, another one sprouts up in its place. Ain't not the truth. Oh, this is just not going to go well, is it? I'm gonna fucking break your jaw. It's gonna be an ambush. No? Oh, I'm surprised. I'm shocked that wasn't an ambush. Oh, here we are. Tumbleweed. Oh. I'm right. Sincerely doubt these scum plan to play fair. They are my ass. You bet. Besides, Norm here is going to be my shield, ain't you, Norm? <laughs> He's my pleasure. Marston, lead Deke into town. Make sure you keep a gun on that son of a bitch. Come on. I'm sure it's been nice for the boys to have a whore to play with. I'm going to fucking remove your teeth by force. 
absolute fucking scumbag. Maybe she won't wanna go home. She said, fuck. Can I just shoot him? Come on now, boys. Cut me loose. Where's Bonnie? I saw Whoa. Damn right, I will. Come on. Don't you fucking dare. Booyah! Ah, oh, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Where's Bonnie? I thought we had a deal. Well, you thought wrong. We don't make deals with the law. There she is. You ain't known fury like John Marston. Motherfuckers. Come on. Damn right. Bonnie, are you okay? I'm fine now, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Thank you. What the hell took you so long, you stupid man? Oh, Bonnie. If you think I'm gonna lower myself by making a joke about being all tied up, you got another thing coming. Come on. She is unflappable. I like this. I like this woman. <laughs> John's like, ah. Oh. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. I'm also glad I got to save Bonnie. I'm thinking, can I drop a 10? Travel back to Armadillo? Yeah, I can. I think that's probably the next thing I need to do, actually. Let's see if then Bonnie's got anything for me.
I bet she does. I hope she does. <clears throat> oh, I was real worried for a moment there that I was gonna. Body one gonna make it, and that just wouldn't do. I wouldn't do at all. Oh, I don't need to be here. I need to go back into town, I guess. See what West Dickens has got for me. <laughs> Old edition newspapers for sale that I can purchase. Sir? By current edition papers. Civil unrest returns to Mexico. Millinery, its finest hats. That's a distinction. Rancher's daughter, Bonnie McFarlane, kidnapped from her home in Hennigan New Austin. Yeah. Spinster of 29 years. <laughs> well past marriageable or childbearing age. Fuck that. Yeah, he's there. London Ricketts. Massacre at Ridgewood. Stretch Hawthorne, the singing blind grave robber. The gayest song and dance you will see this year. A hard gripping musical drama in nine acts. Fantastic. Eee. Kidney beans. Proven to promote healthy and regular odors of night soil. Flock of sparrows, kidney beans. Mary Shackleford, 19. Seeking actors. Fans chewing tobacco. God, the amount of detail in this game is... It's pretty cool. Like, um... I think... I believe... You got yourself a fine pair of eyes. <laughs> I like it. Jelly Jack's plug tobacco. Wonder tonic from the east. The old ways are the best ways. Ah, oh, man, there's so much really cool detail in this game. I'm liking it. I am liking it. Oh. Let's go get that bounty. I'm going to get that bounty. Cheers, bud. Let's see what this bounty is for. I'm going to do a bounty because I feel like killing. Wanted, Morris Sweet, Bollard Twins Gang. Property destruction at Mescalero, $40 alive, $20 dead. Let's go get this motherfucker. Yeah. Alright, Mescalero we go. See what's in my map. No, that's not too far away. I'm not going 
go the straight way though. What's the shortest distance between two points? Straight motherfucking line. <laughs> Not got time to go around the houses looking for a fucking bounty. Sneak up on these motherfuckers. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Come back from that, you motherfucker. I can shut you up if you start hollering. That's how we do it in the West. Alright, here we go. <laughs> really, don't annoy me. Because I will just drop you off my fucking horse. Everyone's dead. Good. I'm making a mistake, am I? All right. On the wrong fucking way, Anna. Can't go over this fucking cliff. No, no, idiot, idiot, jumping off cliffs. Ugh. Everything was going so well. Oh, for God's sake. All right. Let's go get that fucking bounty. Again. What the hell happened there? I mean, I could just kill him, but that's not good. It's only over here.
quiet. I'm hunting rabbits. I mean, technically, I'm hunting outlaws, but let's not split hairs. Did that? With me here? Oh yeah! It worked out so well for you, did it? Yeah! That's what I thought. Fuck you! That's mine. That's mine. That's mine. Right, come on. Alright. Now this time, we're not going to jump off a cliff. That's not going to happen this time. Oh, motherfucker. Where is he? There he is. No, I'll do with him. Hey, de -be -be -be. Get back here. I'm not sorry. Tried to shoot me. Fuck that guy. Yeah. Back we go to the McFarlane's ranch. Hand in a bounty. I bet you are. Uh... Not today, though. Today I'm taking your ass to jail. Hmm. Nom 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 Two right. Tell you what, it's better than a horse riding in Zelda Twilight Princess. Here you go. Much appreciated. So we do it. On a peace peacemaker. Duster coat menu entry. Uh. Okay. We need by here by the top twenty minutes. Yeah, you know what? Buy the map. Sod it. Yep. What I got to sell. Sell the Kugami. Sell the Fever Few, sell the Cougar Claw, sell a couple of horse meat. 
All right. So. Everything's added to the map, I think. In Hennigan's stead. So what's in Hennigan's stead? Not much, I don't think. No, oh, nothing really. I didn't need that map. Oh well. Oh well. I think I discovered them all anyway, probably. But, let's see. Elegant suit. Bod twins. Duster coat. Alright. Let's do that shit. Oh, I'm cool. I'm so cool. Hmm. Kill a cougar with a stick of dynamite. Fantastic. I'm looking forward to seeing where this goes. Oh, man. I need to win at horseshoes to get that. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So I think let's have a game of horseshoes. Let's have a game of horseshoes. Yeah, I'll play a game of horseshoes. Not very good at it, but I'll play it. I'll bet ten dollars. Uh, not quite. No good. No good. Don't want. I just don't want to sit here watching him throw. That was terrible. That was awful. I was awful. No, also not good. Hmm. Yeah. Nope. Nope. Ah, oh, balls it. <clears throat> okay. Good throw. Do a dollar bet. Why not? That was not good. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. I can't actually do this. That was bad. No good. No good at all. Oh, 
Oh, I actually got it in, more or less. Oh, overshot. Hmm. Still getting fucking destroyed here. Ah. I reckon if I go... That was terrible. That was terrible. I can't actually do this. Hmm. That wasn't bad. I mean, it was bad, but... Okay, it went too far. No, higher angle of release, I think. Pull your arm back more to get more... Um, more power. Higher angle of release to get more accuracy. No. A bit more power. Oh! Right. Okay. I have been practicing. I'm starting to get a hang of this now. All right. Overshot. Move that way. Ah. Not good, though. Not good. That was a bit too much. Ah. Oh. I want that costume. I'm going to win a game of horseshoes. It's going to happen. I'll throw some horseshoes. Alright, I'll throw some horseshoes. Get in the hang of this now. Get in the hang of this. Roughly. I need to bet a dollar. I just need to win. Oh yeah! Oh, that was overshot. That was Ooh. It's on the wrist. Just about. Trying to get it though. No good. Fuck that, didn't I? 
Absolutely fuck that. Oh! If you need lessons, I'm your man. That was good. Oh! Huh! That was alright. No, that was bad. Also bad. Also bad. Chris is going to win this one. And I can't have that. Because I need that scrap of the costume. Ah. Uh, oh. I was almost there. Uh, no. Ghost wins that one. He's going to beat me. He's going to beat me, damn it. I need to get a ringer. That was terrible. Man, that was awful. Ah, he's closest. Must be more that way. No. Bad, 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 bad. I'm available for private tutoring. There we go. That's what we want. No. Well, I do believe we're still recording. I honestly thought I'd lost the recording then, because my computer just turned off. 
Turns out it's still recording. That's very impressive. Ah, I'm off. My aim's off. Hmm. Get in there. I think that was lucky. So you've got to give it some swing with the... Okay. Oh! So when you're dead on that, you want to be between the first two lines. Okay. Oh! A little closer. Ah! The problem with physics is it's not a consistent. Oh! Fuck you, Gus McLeod. I hate you. Just want to win a game of horseshoes. Ah. Uh. Ah! Did you see that? I've already lost this game anyway. Shut up. Still want a point, didn't I? Fucker. Actually, I was way off. It needs to be there. Fuck that. Fuck that. It's quite enough of that for one day. Let's get back into town. Return that stolen horse to its owner. Can I lasso it? Can I lasso him? 
Yeah, that's how we do it. Oh, this is not good. Well, looks like my, my, my computer's having a fit, so... I best call it for today, and so I can sort what this is, sort out whatever the problem is before next episode. Um, thanks for sticking with me, by bearing in mind technical difficulties. Um, I'll see you next time. What the fuck's going on here? Right, I'll have to sort this out. Bye.